Danwich School through the ultimate Sweet 16 Friday morning. Dressed in decorative hats, the school celebrated Charter Day, the anniversary of when Stanwich received its charter from the state to become a school. When I came to Stanwich, I was a charter student. So I had the opportunity to be part of a lot of first for Stanwich. I was in the first, second grade, first, third grade, first, fourth grade. But while today Stanwich looks impressively huge and sophisticated to me, the things that are most important haven't really changed at all. I realize now that all the Stanwich lessons I remembered so clearly were the ones that really stay with you for life. The morning was full of song and school spirit, but a highlight was the unveiling of a school bell that belonged to North Coscob School, a one-room schoolhouse that originally inhabited Stanwich's property. The iconic bell was donated to Stanwich School by the Domerick family, who built an estate on the property in 1914 after the one-room schoolhouse closed. And if you notice, I don't know if Sam, can you see it from there? They had a little tower. And in that tower was a school bell, and it rang every day. Uh, and it ushered in the kids. 150 years ago, on this property, there were school children, just like you. I remember there was a school house here. I don't remember seeing it. Um, and then when um, I ran into Beth, actually, and she said that they were looking for the bell, and I said I knew exactly where it was. And my sister had passed away, and it was in Oregon. And so I talked to her husband about it, and he and the two boys all agreed that it was a great idea to give it to the school in memory of Debbie. So everybody's excited about it and very happy about it. The 150-year-old bell will be rung for the first time in May when Stanwich School celebrates its first graduating class of seniors. In Greenwich, Sarah Mitchler, itsrelevant.com.